Hello! In this video, we'll see the plunge roughing. Plunge roughing is a type of milling in which the toolpath passes along the tool axis and machining takes place with its end part. This machining is available for waterline plane and pocketing. The type of the selected operation as a basic one will determine the path of plunger machining. Let's see an example. We'll machine part named part 1. First of all, create a waterline operation from the operation list. Set up the operation so that the milling passes in one pass. Check the path. If it suits us, the next step is to enable the plunger processing option and set its parameters, such as the core radius, the step between the passes, the pullback distance to which the tool and the feed distance are allocated. There is also a parameter that adds an additional pass in areas where the workpiece cannot be machined with this step. In our case, leave everything by default. As a result, we get a path. Next, machine the central wall. It's necessary to drill a hole at the beginning of the toolpath with an incomplete cutting part could machine the area of sampling areas or wells. To do this, add a hole machining operation, indicate the position of the well and calculate the operation. Now we can machine this area by using plunge roughing. Create a pocketing operation. Select a necessary area and the tool. After that, enable plunge roughing and calculate the toolpath. The result you can see on the simulation tab. Thank you for your attention.